In the last section, we talked about Flex Algo or Flexible Algorithm and its application in the segment routing. In this section, we will discuss the implementation details of Flex Algo. Just to have a quick review, Flex Algo allows us to run IGP with different algorithm and with different constraints for different customers. For example, we run IGP for gold customers with the least delay as the best pass and with the constraint of ignoring all unreliable links. And at the same time, run IGP for silver customers but with highest bandwidth as the best pass and without any constraint. How Flex Algo helps in segment routing traffic engineering? You can send each customer's traffic on their own best pass with just one label, since that pass is the best pass in their own algorithm. Another application of Flex Algo was to create a multiplane network, for example, one plane for gold customers and one plane for silver customers, in a way that each plane has its own protection without forwarding traffic to another network plane. This is what I'm going to implement in this section, but without protection. This is the topology in which we are going to implement Flex Algo. We have two PE rotors, PE1 with loopback address 1111 and PE2 with loopback address 2222. We have two paths between PE1 and PE2, one path through P1 and P2 and the other path through P3 and P4. We will put these two paths in two different planes, Flex Algo 128 and Flex Algo 129. I've added two customers on the network, Raika and Company 1 connected to PE routers. A loopback interface is implemented for each customer in PE2, 192, 168, 1 for Raika customer, who is gold customer and 192, 168, 2 for company 1 who is a silver customer. The network is divided in two planes. Flex Algo 128 is implemented in the first plane, which includes rotors PE1, P1, P2 and PE2. Flex Algo 129 is implemented on another plane, which include rotors PE1, P3, P4, and PE2. As you notice, both Flex Algo 128 and 129 are implemented in PE1 and PE2 rotors. But P rotors only participate in one Flex Algo. In this topology, I did not consider any protection nodes and protection links just to simplify the topology. Our goal is to write an ODN policy in the PE1 router so that the goal customer traffic is only forwarded to the network plane with Flex Algo 128 and silver customer traffic to the network plane with Flex Algo 129. Now let's check the configuration details of Flex Algo, the configuration of PE1, PE2 and P1 is displayed here. First, let's check the configuration of PE2 that the Royco and Company 1 are connected to. Royco and Company 1 are connected to. Implementation of ISIS, segment routing and MPLS traffic engineering are displayed here. What is different is the configuration of Flex Algo. I've configured Flex Algo 128 and 129 in PE2. For each Flex Algo, a different prefix SID is advertised. Prefix SID 16002 for normal ISIS. Prefix SID of 16802 for Flex Algo 128 
and prefix SID 16,902 for Flex Algo 129. P2 advertise customer network with the color according to the SLA network from Royka. Customer or advertised color 10 and a network from company 1 or advertised color 20. We have configured to VRF, Raika and company 1 with road target 11 and 12. A loopback interface is configured for each VRF. A road policy is configured in such a way the routes from VRF with RD11 or route distinguisher 11 are advertised with color 10 or SLA gold and routes from VRF with route distinguisher 12 are advertised with color silver or 20. Route distinguisher 11 is configured for Raika and route distinguisher 12 is configured for company 1. In this way, PE1 rotor uh, will receive the rows with their corresponding color. As you see, the road policy is applied to the neighbor 1111 when the roads are advertised to the PE1 rotor. Now let's check the configuration of PE1 rotor. The same configuration as the PE2 rotor exists in PE1 rotor. ISIS, segment routing, and MPLS traffic engineering are also configured in P1 rotor. Like PE2, Flex Algo 128 and Flex Algo 129 are also configured in P1. A different prefix SID is configured for each Flex Algo. Two VRFs, Raika and Company 1, and BGP with address family. A VPN V4 is configured also in P1 rotor. What is different in P1 is that we have also configured ODN policy for segment routing. It is ODN policy because the destination of the policy are not configured. Any traffic belonging to the road with color 10 will be forwarded on the base IGP pass in Flex Algo 128 and any traffic belonging to road with color 20 will be forwarded on the base IGP pass but in Flex Algo 129. So we expect that any traffic belonging to gold customers will be forwarded through P1 and P2 routers since they belongs to Flex Algo 128 and any traffic belonging to the silver customers will be forwarded through P3 and P4 rotors. Now let's check the configuration of P1 rotor, ISIS, segment routing and MPLS traffic engineering are also configured in P1 rotor. The only difference is that only Flex Algo 128 is configured in P1 rotor, not 129. In P1 and P2, we only activate Flex Algo 128 and in P3 and P4, we only activate Flex Algo 129. Now let's look at the result of our configuration. First, we can use show MPLS forwarding command to ensure that a different prefix SID is advertised for each flex algo by ISIS. As you can see, for example, prefix SID 16002 for our normal ISIS, 16802 for flex algo 128, and through Giga Ethernet 000 and uh, 16902 for Flex Algo 129 through Giga Ethernet 0001 is announced by PE2 routers. With the command show BGP VPN V4 Unicast, as you can see, 
roads from Royco and Company 1 are advertised with appropriate color, color 10 and color 20. The road 192, 168, one with color 10 related to VRF Royco and 192, 168, two with color 20 for Company 1 are learned in PE1 rotor. Let us now check the result of our ODN policy in P1 rotor with the command show segment routing traffic engineering policies. As you can see, two dynamic policies are created, one for color 10 routes and for destination 2222. And the other for color 20 and with destination 2222. Two, two, two. Both policies are up and up. Admin and operational are up. First policy, forward traffic in flex algo 120A. And the second policy, we forward traffic in flex algo 129. The binding SID assigned to the first policy is 24006 and the binding SID assigned to the second policy is 24007 also with command trace route segment routing MPLS NILFEC policy Binding SID this, uh, 24006 and 7. We can ensure that gold traffic is forwarded via P1 and P2, and silver traffic is forwarded through P3 and P4 rotor. I can see rotor P1, P1, P2, and then P2, and also check for the binding SID 24007. The pass is PE1, P3, P4, and then PE2.